Hello gamers, my name is Youngblood and welcome to a game called Papers, Please! A game that I played for about 40 minutes and then none of the recordings saved, so we're gonna start this again. Ho provided that it's going to let me start a new game. It is not. Oh no, I can, I can start a new game. So I played almost a week of this. So the point of the game is that you are a- congratulations, I'm gonna read this real quick. Provided that my- I don't wanna know that, computer. Stop giving me pop-ups. The October later the the bleh, bleh, the October labor lottery is complete. Your name was pulled. For immediate placement, report to the Ministry of Admission at Greston Border Checkpoint. An apartment will be provided for you and your family in East Greston. Expect a class eight dwelling. Glory to our Stotska. So the whole point of this game is that I am like the security person at a checkpoint and it is my job to make sure that nobody gets to the checkpoint that is not supposed to. After six long years, can the Ministry of Admission keep us safe? I'm gonna try to get through this first level a little bit quickly because there's kind of- there's not really a story to this game, but it- One second. So I've read all of this already. I'm- first day, I'm not allowed to let foreigners through. So, next, which is actually the first, because this is my first day and you're the first person. So, you're from Artstatska. This thing will tell me, well actually no, the passport itself will tell me, you're from Artstatska. And I need to make sure the, the, what am I saying? The passport is valid by making sure that the issuing city is the same as the cities that issue passports. So this is cool, it's all like valid and stuff so i'm going to approve it and i'm going to give it back to her i'm gonna get there you go so i get paid like five dollars for every person that comes through here next oh i have to make sure the pictures match up this checkpoint is smaller than i expected you know what your face is smaller than i expected and i can't let you through because you're not from here, and we're racist here. Our stat skins only. So I get paid like five dollars for every checkpoint, and that's important because I need to manage my money. I've waited in this dang line for eight hours. I hope it was worth it. It was not. You should you should have come here like later in the week. Bye. Yep. Sorry. Next. Uh, I hate how the music goes away when you do this. You are from Artstatska. Your passport is valid. And you match the picture. Or match phone. Or, yep. So I'm going to go ahead and let you through. It'll show it later after the screen. But there's a whole, like, money managing system where I have to take care of my family and make enough to get through the day and everything. So I'm going to try to filter people through as quickly as possible. Okay, that person did not have papers. I'm gonna try to filter people through as quickly as possible so I can make as much money today, because in the future days it gets harder. Orvech Vonner. It's valid. Cool. Because right now I just have to make sure that you're from Artstatska, you're from Artstatska, your passport is valid, we're all good. But in the future you have to like... You have to see that the passport is valid, and then you have to check, like, their entry ticket. It just, it gets harder. So. You are not from Artsatska. Denied. I can't. There we go. Partially denied, because I didn't stamp it all the way, but who cares? That's not important. What's important is, you're not getting in. You are also not from Artsatska. So, bye. And that horn signals the end of my day. I wonder if I can get one more person through here. Come, uh, nope, come back at 6 a.m. tomorrow. So this is it. This is my manage your, manage your expenses by using the check boxes below. So I have enough money for food, for heat, for rent, and I have $20 left over. So, cool, I think. Yeah. 
but I still didn't make enough to get through the day because this cost me $50 and I only made 40 so I'm $10 behind. Oh, I have four passports because I have four, like, okay, I have four people in my family. We're gonna go to sleep. We're gonna end the day right here. The Gresson checkpoint is, is a success. So now they're gonna start letting foreigners into the border. And I just have to make sure, yeah, foreigners with a valid passport are permitted to enter. So I just need to make sure, let's see the post bound, yeah. I just need to make sure that their passport is valid. And if it's not valid, I can always check it with like the discrepancies thing. Hello. Oh, I'm gonna pull this thing out because this will help me determine because like it says here issuing cities like only these cities can give you a passport so if you have a passport that's from another city i can't let you through true glorian uh your pictures match passport is valid you can come into the country please close that now thank you there you go your passport is valid cool yeah, I'm gonna make, I was trying to make sure if they matched the photo. There you go. Next! I missed something. Dang it. What do you mean, valid issuing city? I knew I knew I was missing something with that one. Okay, so you're from Artsatska. Paradisna. Para, para, para Paradisna. It's valid, it looks valid. Is it valid? I feel bad for like denying people access, but at the same time I'm just like terrified that I'm gonna get one of those citations and I'll get fired and then my family will die and starve in that order. You are from or Obristan. Lord Naz, Lord Naz, 1980. <laughs> okay, that scared me. It genuinely scared me. Oh yeah, and then there's this, this dude who's trying to cause trouble. I didn't even see him. And yeah, that's terrible. And they died. So this is where it gets a lot harder because they're just like, progress is saved at the start of each day. Plus I didn't make as much money that day. So now we can't have heat. Now my whole family's gonna be cold. Thanks terrorists. But anyways, yeah, so I don't get paid for anyone after that, obviously. And now the game's gonna get a lot harder because they're like, we have to check passport tickets in these passports. So. Yeah, they need a valid entry ticket. Alright, who's first? I'm gonna pull out my handy dandy book, Integra. So have to make sure your ticket is valid. Yeah, it's valid today. And you are from Glorian. Pictures match, yeah, cool. Oh, come on. Approved. There you go, and there you go. Welcome to Artsatska. Next! And yet I, I say I, I need to stop shouting, yet I keep shouting. Okay, what is that? Frog picture. United Federation. You were from, you don't, you don't have a, okay. You do not have a ticket. Oh, wait, no, I need to highlight, I need to highlight the rule in the rule books. Yeah, all it says foreigners require an entry ticket and you don't have one. So I'm going to interrogate you. Cool. You have a valid ticket, awesome. Your, I think your passport is valid. Shingleton, is that a place? Yeah, Shingleton. Cool. I'm gonna let you through. There you go. And there you go. Enjoy your visit towards Saska. Or like your move towards Saska. Or your job. Whatever. Whatever you're here. Papers, please. Hey there. I can make you happy anytime. Thanks. Thanks for that. If I'm ever feeling lonely, which I wouldn't because I have a wife, I will visit East Creston. Oh, wait, I gotta make sure your ticket is valid. 1922, 1120, but yep. 
So, Sinkaido, 1984. You look the same in your photo. Awesome. Approved. Love how I don't even try to get it in the stamp. I'm just like, ka -chunk. There you go. Come to Pink Vice. Ask for Ava. Thanks. Maybe I'll send my uncle there. Because he lives with me, apparently. Okay, and you are from... Nope, wait, that one's down here. What was that? Oh, oh, nope, that was a republic. Republia. And your ticket is valid. Cool. From Boston, 1982. Your passport's expired, though. I'm going to ask you... Nope. Let's see. Where is it? Okay. Entrance. All documents must be... All documents must be current. And yours is not. So, what's the deal here, bud? The document has expired. What? That is a mistake. I just renewed it. Yeah, it doesn't look too renewed to me, so... ha -boink. Sorry. Just doing my job. I think I get two warnings per day with this ticket. Like, if I get two of these, I'm cool, but if I get a third, I'm assuming, because I've never gotten three, I got two a couple times. Like, this one says, like, warning issued, no penalty in the next one. Oh, this guy! This guy! Papers, please. Okay, here we go. Glory to our Saska, the greatest country. And then he doesn't present me any papers, so I have to bring up the rule book and just be like, hey, you have to have a passport. You don't have a passport. I'm gonna ask you about that. Where is your passport? Passport? I thought it so great. Passport not required. Right? Yeah, you need a passport. I come back again. See, so yeah, I got two of these citations before. The first one said, warning issued, no penalty. And then the sec one, second one was like, this is your final warning. So I'm assuming the third warning, I either get penalized or I'm just fired. My whole family is cold. You're not gonna freeze to death, are you? Can we go without food for a day? I think so. Then I can put some money in my savings at the same time. I need to get more passports through. I need to be better at this. Okay. Black market activity explodes. So now it's gonna get harder. Because I think I have to check, like, an extra thing. Yeah. <clears throat> Losing my voice. Um... Our thoughts and citizens must show their ID card and foreigners must have a valid entry ticket. Hello. What is the purpose of your trip? You are transiting for two weeks. It's a long transit. Your passport is valid. Your city. Yep. And this is... It's got to match the passport. So it has to match the number and everything. Looks good. Welcome to our Tsatska. What? Oh. Okay. Well, I should pay attention to that then. You're visiting your son, which you have not seen in six years. Okay. Visit six months. But, oh, but the entry thing is not valid. Well, we just started issuing the entry permits. How does someone have one that's not valid? I'm sorry. But... Well, actually, I should I should ask you about this. Uh, let's see. This says. Yep, the document has expired. Your son is waiting. I'm sorry, but I have a family to feed, and if I let you through, I could lose my job. Sorry. I let that lady through last time accidentally because I didn't realize that her thing was expired. I look, and it starts, and art starts, I don't, art starts skin. So you are from Parad, Disna, and your passport should match. Yep, I just wanna make sure that this is, cause there's like a list of cities, there's a list of districts that can issue these. The Alton districts, yep, okay. And if I stamp it, if it's from the wrong city, then I will be no bueno. Next. It's a lot to check.
What do you mean non-matching photo? Uh, see, if I let the lady through, that would be my, like, violation. Okay, you're visiting for two weeks. Cool. That's valid. Does it match your passport? It matches your passport. Tessa Marlowe. I just gotta make sure that your passport is cool and good. I thought that passport photo looked a little weird because they didn't have the bun on top. I'm just like, yeah, they probably changed their hairstyle. Man, they are strict on this. What else am I looking for? Oh, I was just trying to make sure that was not... Okay. I was looking to see if it was expired or not. Words fail me. I'm sorry. I love how I'm just like... There you go. There's your documents back. Ugh. Invalid name. Great. Now I have three citations on the- Can I just go home? Can I just deny everybody else and go home? I guess I could. Oh, it's this guy. Okay, hello again. Now I have passport. This is not a valid passport, dude. This is not a real passport. This passport is crude fake. Hey now, it's not true. It's pre-approved. Well, then, why do you look at me to approve it, then? Because I'm not going to. Oh, I got the stamp on the stamp, actually. Corbrastan is not a real country. Okay, okay. You know, like, passport. I understand. I come back again with better one. Like a real one? I hope so. Your son is sick and need medicine, and the rent has gone up. Great. And I do not have enough to give any of my people food. Wow, okay. So they're hungry, but at least they're not cold. It's just like, you miss this one tiny thing that you're like, oh, I never would have thought of that. And it's just like, citation. I'd have enough for food if I didn't get docked for letting that one person through. I let the lady who didn't want to, like, I let the lady who couldn't see her son for six years through, but I let all these other people through that shouldn't have gone through. Okay, I'm gonna play one more day. I'm gonna feed, I'm gonna give my son medicine. We're all gonna sleep. Please nobody die. Republican track star wanted for murder. Vince Lestrade's whereabouts unknown has likely fled Republica. Okay, last time I was so into the zone of the game that I was checking a passport and I was like, okay, this is good, this is good, this is valid. I let the guy through and what do I, I set this paper aside, like this newspaper right here. I set this aside, I was like, okay, I'm gonna watch out for the name Vince Lestrade or anyone who looks like him. Cause I want, I was like, I don't want to have to, like, let the murderer through. And I got so into checking this one person's passport that I let the person through and the passport said Vince Lestrade on it. Like, I, I just straight up read the name and let him through anyways because I was so into checking the passport. I'm just like, meh. Whatever. What is the purpose of your trip? You've come to work for a full year. Is that what this says? Yep. Enter by cool Joshua Kowalski. Your things do not match. I'm gonna ask you about that. There's a discrepancy here. What am I talking about? Don't arrest me, just deny my passport and I will go away. Okay, there's no need I don't see a need to detain you. So I'm just gonna deny your passport. And you can go away. I arrested the first person who did that. Because I was like, oh, you might be the murderer. And then I just let the murderer through. So I was like, your passport's valid, Joshua. Or Vince Lestrade. You are in transit for... Only two weeks. Transit, 14 days. Valid. Make sure these numbers match. They do. Yvi Falloon. What a name. Okay, so that's good. United Federation. It says male here. And normally, okay, normally I don't judge. But I know the game probably wants me to. So I'm gonna ask. Are you a woman or a man? As the document says. Okay. Alright, fine. Like I said, I don't judge, but I don't want the game to dock me to be like, oh, this was an invalid passport. So, it uh, expires. Oh, wait, I should probably check. Oh, it doesn't say birth date on there. Never mind. From Great Rapid. Cool. Looks good. I'm gonna let you through, sir. And take that back. Thank you. 
If this docks me for that. What do you mean, invalid gender? <sighs> okay, you're in transit for a couple of weeks. So it says the passport. Uh, oh, this is the dude! This is the dude! This is Vince Lestrade! I'm just gonna, um, I'm gonna ask you about that. No? Okay. Hold on. Hold on. I'm gonna see if I can bring up the paper. There we go. Are you Vince Lestrade? Dang. Look, I did not kill her. I was set up. I do not believe the Republican- do not believe the Republican lies. Let me through. Ooh. Ooh, this is a good- this is a good question, because last time I let him through, and I didn't get docked anything for it, which... Then here's the question. Do I- you know what? I'm gonna let him through. I'm gonna let him through and see what happens, because I- like- Like, I'm- I'm- I am- I don't know. Because, like, normal- in a normal situation, I'd just be like, No, that's what everybody says. Of course you didn't kill her. I'm gonna detain you. But- in this scenario, like, I don't know. I don't know what to do. No, I'm gonna ra I'm gonna detain him because there's like people always say like I didn't kill her, but like this is not this is not the fugitive. She is not like. But then what? Like, this is this is quite the dilemma because like, if you think he's innocent, you can just let him through, and like I won't get docked or anything. Nobody will bat an eye. But, like, then if he's guilty, I would just let a murderer through the border. And, and, like, who am I to determine who is innocent or guilty? Like, that's the job of the law. But, like, if the law is flawed and I, like, and I say that this person is guilty, or, like, not say that they're guilty, but, like, I send them to the law and the law is flawed, they're gonna be like, oh, it's guilty, but he might not actually be guilty. But I don't know anything about this world, so I don't know, like, I don't know if he's actually like guilty i don't know if republic is go wait text messages i don't know if republic actually republic actually is like a flawed place i don't know like this is a moral dilemma and i'm probably making it much more complicated than it is but yeah okay i'm gonna let i'm gonna let you through because at the end of the day all i care about do i get docked if i know he's vince lestrade Let's see. I'm gonna make sure these all match because I don't want to get docked because they're like, oh, his passport was fake. Oh, where are you from? Oh, you're from somewhere else. Oh, Republia. Okay. Duh. I was like, this doesn't match. Boston. Let's see. Yep. Oh, gotta get that. There you go. There you go. There he goes. Again. Second time I've let him through. But th I noticed this time. I knew who it was. Oh, I spent so much time debating that I'm not going to be able to make enough money. Ah, no. You have no entry permit. Do I need one? Yes, you do. So I'm going to have to deny you. Sorry. Sorry. Gotta have an entry permit. I really don't know how much time I have. Like, this clock is not helpful. Jay, it's a beautiful day, my friend. Finally come free of charging tyranny. Okay, so you're, you're trying to immigrate. So it'll say immigrate forever. Yeah, that's valid. Uh, Victor Vostok. Okay, cool. Just gotta make sure Glorian, all that is good. Welcome to Artstatska. You are welcome. He's behind him. Oh, oh, this is like this is a scenario where like his. I went through this last time. His passport is valid. Her passport is not. Yeah, yeah. So like, cause I'm. Let's see. Foreigners require an entry permit. And she doesn't have one. Please, I beg you. I have one violation. 
so I can afford to have another. I don't think they stack. But no, I didn't mean to deny it! What does that do? <laughs> I've both denied and approved your passport. Maybe if I just approve it a bunch of times, it'll get the message across. No, 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 I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to, crap. Oh, I gotta pay more attention. I just accidentally sent, I'm, ugh, I'm so bad at this. I let a murderer through the gates. Like I chose to let a murderer through the gates, but I didn't let the woman to see her husband through. All of my people are sick. And then I didn't let the lady go through to see her son. Applicants entering after 6 p.m. are unpaid. Why? Why did that happen? Great. Great. Everyone in my life is dying. I can't afford medicine for everybody, so I'm just gonna give it to my wife and son. <sighs> Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. If you like this video, please hit the button that tells me you did, and if you want to see more of where this came from, hit the annotation at the end of the video, or subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you next time.